Okay, yeah, it is, it's time. It's that time to get some defensive powers in here. Even though uh, Multi Nanaro has two bays, one defense, one stamina, it's about to go on a showdown today. Guys, I think we can all sit there and say, yes, uh, Kabeus or Kerbius had to be the one to take on Multi Nanaro with her defensive type Bay. But then what would happen with her stamina type Bay, Wizard Arrow? I could have got another stamina Beyblade, but that would have been Ragnarok and that would have been crazy because there's so many of them. So what I done was I got two of the original, the strongest defense type Beyblades from the start of Burst, which was Ken and Wakia, Wyvern and Kerbius to take on Multi Nanaro and her two bays. Her two bays, that is why. Because she controls two. Now, if you guys don't know Multi Nanaro, I'm hoping I'm saying this name right, because this is what I've been saying for a hot minute. So Multi Nanaro, I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know if that's correct how I'm saying it. It might have a different pronunciation. You guys can let me know in the comments below. I'm kind of just reading how it looks. Uh, but anyway, uh, here she is. She's actually awesome. So when she has, I believe, is it Wizard Arrow or is it Knight? Nah, I'm not too sure which one it is. But she has like this kind of like top hat, which makes it kind of look like a wizard which, or, or a magician, which kind of makes me think is this one when she wears it like that. But regardless, anyway, Multi Nanaro is in the X generation. She fights her base, Wizard Arrow and Knight Shield. She controls two bays, not just one. One bay that has some shenanigans where it changes into this mode and that mode. No, she went, you know what? I'm the best in the world. I want two bay. Who has two bay blades? I'll tell you who. Multi Nanaro, she has two Beyblades. That's just so cool. Uh, but all right, anyway, guys, if we come down here, we can see a little bit of information about her. I'll tell you guys this all the time. If there's any information you guys want to find out about anything to do with Beyblades, Beyblade Wiki, that's where it's at. Go there, check it out. So Wizard Arrow, we already know it's a stamina type. Then we come over to the uh, Knight Shield, which is a defense type. You can kind of tell with the green and the yellow or is it meant to be orange whatever it's stamina type uh we come down here we already know that she is a part of does it tell you does it tell you if she is a part of no it doesn't all right so she is a part of team persona which it does not tell you on this right now for some weird reason but it should do she is a part of team persona and I'll get it right here, I'll get it right here. So Team Persona, if you guys don't know, is a team in the Beyblade X. She is one of the members, you guys can see right there. And uh, that's what we're gonna be doing today. Today, we're gonna be doing this. We're gonna take Molten Inaro, her two bays, to face off against two defense, two of the original defensive type Beyblades, Kerbius, Wyvern, it's going down. That's how it's gotta be. Starting from the first evolutions, going up to each evolution, all the way through till we find. Oh, I just realized Kerbius actually has an extra bay over Wyvern. I didn't even notice that before. All right, so, but what we're gonna do is this Beyblade's gonna face up against all of them. This one's gonna face up against all of them. We're gonna see if uh, Eva. Ken or Wakia can take out Multi Nanaro's Beyblades and with which evolution of their burst bays can actually get the job done. I think it's time to get into the stadium and start hearing this noise. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. I love Beyblades. All right, guys, let's enter the stadium. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, guys, Wizard Arrow and Wyvern in first. Let's see what happens with the first evolution of Wakia's Beyblade against Multi Nanaro. Here we go. We have the obviously stamina type going up against a defensive type, but it is a first evolution. And you know what, guys? It's actually doing pretty good on stamina and it's not bursting, but it does lose for the first point one nil. Three, two, one, go shoot. Woo! All right, guys, you know the rules. You burst, you lose first to two points. That is the rules today. And the Wakia's defense is actually on a point. It's not bursting. And you can hear them attacks when they are making contact. So you guys know that the first evolution of this defense type baby really is actually that strong. All right, guys, let's get in against Wakia next Night Shield. 
Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! Time to find out what's gonna happen now with a defensive tie versus a defensive tie. We get a burst! Holy moly! That was absolutely epic. Rules, you burst, you lose. Let's bring in a Kirby's burst against Wizard Arrow. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! All right, guys, we've seen Wyvern burst. Are we going to see Kirby's burst? It's crazy how a defensive type x Bay can burst Beyblades, but not a stamina type. That is insane. Is it to do? I have no idea what it's to do with. You guys can let us know in the comments below, but there is too much stamina from Wizard Arrow from the first point. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! Oh my dudes, I feel a burst coming. There's enough speed and power in this uh, Wizard Beyblade to get it. I'm just not seeing it. I want to see an epic burst. You know what, guys? If this bay don't do it, then I have a feeling that Night Shield will do it next, man. All right. So it seems like uh, this Wizard Arrow does have a bunch of stamina, and it is too much for Kerbius. But now let's see what Night Shield can do next. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! Are we able to burst this Kerbius Bay with this awesome, look at this guy, the attack patterns right there from Night Shield on Kerbius is so good. We get another burst. This is the burst in Bay right here. Holy moly. All right, guys, moving over to the next evolution. We get in Wyvern again against the Wizards. Three, two, one, go shoot! And now moving over to another evolution of Wakia's Bay. Can it handle the stamina from Wizard Arrow this time? Because now it's got Orbit in there, so it does actually uh, have a better driver. But is it good enough? That is the question. It just got annihilated. It got burst. Rules, you burst, you lose. Let's see now if the Knight can burst it. Three, two, one, go shoot! Whoa! Holy moly, Wakia wanted to use the gimmick from this stadium and uh, he couldn't handle it. He even got burst. This Beyblade has now burned every single bay it's gone against in the stadium. That is crazy. All right, guys, next evolution for Kerbius. Let's go. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! Are we able to take out the next evolution of Kerbius? Kaiser Kerbius is here right now. I'm hoping we can actually burst it with the night again. That would be kind of crazy because this version of Kerbius is a lot more stronger with that defense, but has a ton less stamina. 1 0. 3, 2, 1, go shoot! Woo! I want to show the power of Kerbius and his defense right now, guys. No joke. I want to see if it can handle all of the attacks from both sets of Maltese bays, because that would be so, so crazy if we could actually not burst. All right, here we go, guys. It's going to be out of stamina because it's got too much stamina. But let's see what the Knight can do next. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! All right, guys, we've burst three bays so far. Can we burst the fourth? It will be absolutely epic if we found a way to burst Kaiser Kerbius. But looking at these hits, I don't think we're going to be able to, guys. Kaiser Kerbius' defense is just way too strong. 1-0. Three, two, one, go shoot! And the second time in the stadium, I feel like the absorbing power of Kaiser Kirby has et them attacks alive with the three-headed dog and uh, Night Shield's attacks. Didn't do nothing. And again, we couldn't make it through the defense of this bay right here. Moving over to the next evolution, Tornado Wyvern. Let's do this. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! All right, my dudes, this is the Atomic Driver right here. So this driver has a whole bunch of stamina, and this is where it really gets dicey with the X Bays now, because there's more stamina jumping in with each evolution of these Beyblades, but can it still take them out? The balance not looking good on Tornado, and it goes down 1-0. Three, two, one, go shoot! Woo! 
and my dudes, it's coming. I can feel it in the stadium. We're going to win, but I don't know if we're going to get a burst because Tornado Wyvern has that chain blade around it. And when it attacks, it just goes onto the chain blade and it actually doesn't go onto the layer. So here we go. Are we going to get another stamina win? Atomic Driver is not top tier in the X evolution or generation we stay. Let's get in the night. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, my dudes. Now we're gonna find out if the Knight Shield can break through that defense. There's too much movement on Tornado Wyvern, as you guys can see. Nice attack, but it doesn't look like we're gonna be able to burst Tornado Wyvern. It's been putting up too much of a battle. Its defense is too strong, one nil. Three, two, one, go shoot. Woo! Oh, whoa! Yo, it activated its gimmick. Yo, uh, Night Shield knows it needed to activate the gimmick to get some more powerful attacks on Tornado Wyvern to try and break it through. And it did! We found a way through the defensive powers. Another burst for the night. That is absolutely insane. All right, guys, moving over to the next evolution of Kerbius. Let's do this. Three, two, one, go shoot. Woo! Are we able to burst Guardian Kerbius? Normally this bay bursts every single time, but it doesn't look like it's gonna burst straight away against Wizard Arrow. Holy moly, and it's got Revolve on it as well. So, it, oh, it burst. It, yep, yeah, I was gonna say it's got more stamina, but no, it actually did burst that time. Let's get the night in. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, my dudes, this is a... It was a double burst, but Kerbius did burst first. Holy moly. All right, guys, moving over to the next evolution again of Kerbius. Let's go. Three, two, one, go shoot. Woo! Yo! We have not seen Wizard Arrow act like that yet. Wow. That is crazy. It went from stamina to attack bay very very quick right there. Did it do it? Oh, we burst as a Kerbius. No way. That was so cool. All right, can we do it with this one? Three, two, one, go shoot. And guys, I am very curious to see now. Oh, yo. yo, they turned into attacking bays. This gimmick is so good. We just knocked him out. You guys know the rules. These are two points. This is three points. First two points, you lose. You are out of here. All right, guys, let's bring on the final evolution of Wyvern. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, guys, can we take out the last evolution of Wyvern? Wakia's Beyblade, the big, the strongest, the, the, the driver on is not the best, but let's see if the weight is gonna help it get a whole bunch of stamina, which it actually might do, guys. So here we go. Let's see, has it got enough balance? No, it doesn't, one nil. Three, two, one, go shoot. Woo! All right, guys, we didn't burst it in that first round, but can we burst it in the second round right now? I don't think that this Wyvern has the best balance to deal with a stamina type bay. So it's all gonna come down probably to the next round. I really wanna burst it. If we can burst it, it'll be so awesome. All right, guys, the night is next. Three, two, one, go shoot. Oh, again, holy moly. I thought we was about to activate the gimmick on the stadium to turn to an attack type bay. That is what is awesome about this whole gimmick, guys. You can turn a stamina or defensive bay into a full on attacking beast mode, man. Here we go. Oh, the knight gets in. Three, two, one, go shoot. Woo! Come on, there it is. Oh, the gimmick almost activated again. Holy moly. Only if there was a little bit better balance from Wyvern, it might actually get stamina wins. But you know what? The defensive abilities is pretty good. And it does go down again right there, guys. All right, last evolution now of Kerbius. Let's battle. Three, two, one, go shoot. And we are off now for the final battles with these Beyblades right here. Ken has entered the stadium once again to prove that he is stronger than the new X generation. But is this going to be enough 
to take it out. We're about to find out right now, right here. Stamina, defense, X and burst, head to head. Oh, oof. Ooh, a draw. We're going with a draw. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, guys, that was the first draw we've had of these battles right here. Wizard Arrow not having none of that. It burst. No way, Wizard Arrow has burst. The rules, you burst, you lose. Holy moly, let's get the knight in next. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, guys, we saw one X Bay burst. Will we see another burst right now? I am still in shock that uh, Wizard Arrow actually burst right there. That was insane. I, I'm in shock, guys. We've seen burst today. We've seen smash attacks. We've seen stamina wins. We've seen it all, man. And Kerbius just laughs and says, I win 1-0. Three, two, one, go shoot. And my dudes, we need to get revolve. Dude, we're no! We three points. You are correct. That is three points. Ken's final evolution was far too strong for the X base. Multi Nanaro coming in with two bays right there, facing off against Wakia and Ken. She did her best, but Ken's final evolution was far too strong for them, man. All right, guys, if you want to see Multi Nanaro and her two stamina and defense type bays go up against a burst evolution or even some more X bays, let us know in the comments below who we should be doing next against her. But until then, we'll, we'll see, see you in the, the next episode. Do yeah.